What's up YouTube? I am back with another product review video and I know that this is not directly related to my channel which is about photography and videography but for people like me who spend a lot of their time behind the computer to edit photos and videos this could be a really awesome tool and it could become really handy. So let's watch the intro and I tell you why. I'm not sure if you are familiar with the Logitech MX Master series mouses but this is the third version of their mouses and it was built with the mindset to give the maximum comfort while holding this mouse in the hand. The design of this mouse is so good and I mean it has been crafted so precisely to be in the ergonomics of human hand. In the box you will get the mouse and also you will get a USB receiver but I also should mention that you can connect this mouse to your PC using a Bluetooth and you will also receive a USB-C charging cable and also some instruction papers. As Logitech has mentioned, this mouse will give you 70 days of usage on a full charge and also if you charge it for 1 minute, you can use it for 3 hours which is really insane. Now let's take a look at some of the special features of this mouse. One of the unique features of this mouse is the scroll wheel. It uses an electromagnetic wheel which will provide you with two different scrolling options. One of them is ratchet mode and the other one is free spin mode. In the ratchet mode you just turn the scroll wheel and it moves really precisely step by step. And when you want to go into free spin mode, you just turn the scroll wheel and release it and as you see it spins so fast and you, can, you could scroll between thousands of pages really fast which is really awesome. Another unique feature of this mouse is the thumb wheel. You can use the thumb wheel in so many different apps and you can even customize it with the Logitech Options software. Now let's jump into my PC and I'll show you these awesome features. So here is the Logitech Options software and when you go through the features it would give you some explanations about the mag speed as I said and also there is a mode shift which you can toggle between the ratchet and free spin mode. You will also see a gesture button, I do not use this button so much but it is here, you can use it to move between the windows, it could be useful for you. And here is a thumb wheel as I said. You can use it for so many different apps and as you see for Excel for example you can use it to move really fast between the columns and it is really good for Excel. In Premiere you can use it to scroll in the timeline which is really good and handy. In the Chrome for example you can use it to change between the tabs and it has so many different features in so many different apps which you can see here. It would give you some predefined settings for different apps. But again, you can customize them in the app. As you see here, I will continue and go to the options app. You can see here we have all applications. We can, for example, choose Photoshop and then you can here customize it for different options here and use it to your liking, which is really awesome. So there were some people on the internet saying that the scroll wheel of the MX Master 3 is not good. It's not working well. It has lags and delays. So I'm just going to show you how this works. Uh, I, I do not have any problem with it as you, as you see here. I can really easily move between the rows and if I go into free spin mode it just goes so fast into 2000 to 3000 as you see here. Again I can go up in free spin mode really fast and if I hold it it would, it would stop. Again I can go really fast without any problem. I do not have any problem with the scroll wheel. It works really fine both in ratchet mode and free spin mode. Again, here in a website, you can see I can easily move, uh, scroll the page without any problem. If I go into free spin mode, it goes really fast and I do not have any lags or delays. Again, here in YouTube, you see it, it is working really fine in ratchet mode and here I can go in free spin mode. I do not have any problem really with the scroll wheel and I haven't seen any issues. And here in a PDF, Again, I can move really fast between the pages in free spin mode and if I hold it and here is the ratchet mode, I do not have any problem with it. It works really fine. Overall, I can say that this is the most comfortable mouse which you can get for your hands. It might not be the highest DPI mouse out there like the gaming mouses, but it feels really natural in your hand and you can use it for so many hours 
without feeling any fatigue in your hand. At first it might be a little bit different when you are coming from a different mouse but when you get used to this you just not go back to your traditional mouses anymore because this is just so freaking comfortable. Thank you so much for watching this review guys I really hope you enjoyed it and it was useful for you if you have any questions please do not forget to drop them in the comment sections I would be really glad to answer them and I will be seeing you in my next videos. Have a great day!